I am planning my embryo transfer with maximum two blastocyst embryo, I should freeze two embryos only on one straw. If I am freezing more than two blastocyst on one straw, when I thaw the straw, then I have to thaw all three embryos. So if I am thawing all three embryos, the third embryo, if I am not going to transfer, it might get wasted. But day three embryos, because we can transfer maximum three embryos in one time, we can freeze all three together. But if somebody is planning for single embryo transfer, it is advisable to make that decision before you freeze your embryos. So whenever we are explaining for single embryo transfer, which is more safe compared to double embryo transfer to reduce the risk of twin pregnancy, we discuss this at the start of IVF cycle and also on the day of freezing of embryos. Because if I am planning single embryo, we should be freezing one embryo per straw. So when I am thawing the straw, I have to remove only that particular embryo. If I keep two embryos on one straw and if I want only one to be transferred, after thawing the remaining embryo, either we have to discard or refreeze. So refreezing will also involve the cost and repeated freezing thawing to the embryo may slightly reduce its quality and chances of implantation. So it is very important to take your decision about embryo freezing and embryo transfer at the start of your IVF cycle or at least on the day of embryo freezing.